I didn't get supplies I needed to do soap or wax today. And yesterday was mostly just opening, like, tutorial anyway, so... I figured we could get a little bit further in now that we're not caught up in tutorial mode anymore. Nope, I'm gonna drown if I try to go out that far. Maybe? Are these swords... Are these the swords he trains with? They're all rusty and don't look like they've been used in years. Nope, it will not let me wall jump from the water. That might be a skill we gotta get later or something. Okay, so we helped Susano get rid of the blockade. But we are gonna go feed some voids, because there's some birds over here who will be our friends. And that way we get more praise. And as far as I can tell, this is still like an un unskippable little cutscene, but it's cute. Hello! Oh, apparently, plus sign skip. Yes, I love the art for this game so much. Okay, we got three praise from our little birdie friends. And were there? I think there's some more up here that I didn't have seeds for yesterday. Because I bought some from the vendor guy. There we go. As nice as the art is, I'm sure nobody wants to watch the spinning birds. We might just stick out through the first one of each animal. So far, all we've got is seeds, so all we can feed are birds, because I don't think the rabbits would like seeds. So we got Susano to cut the big rock that was over here, so I think we can leave uh, the Kamiki village area now. And head up, yes. Unless the... Unless he soon tells us no, because we got more stuff to figure out. Shinshu Field. I'm going to butcher some of these names, even though I've played this game before. Huh? You probably know this already, Ami, but this here is Shinshu Field, the most beautiful field in Nippon. At least it's supposed to be. But ever since that incident, I've been getting a bad vibe. We better watch where we're going. You can look at the map by holding down ZL. Let's pay attention to the map as we push ahead. Yeah, this isn't looking... Good. Seems like a problem, in fact. Okay. Smashy pot. Smashy pot. Got some apples. Oh good, our bag's almost full, so if I die, die. I can revive. Ami, that's the first guardian sapling marked on our map. 
It's supposed to be a place for travelers to rest and recuperate. But just look at it. It looks like it could fall over at any moment. This place is definitely cursed from the looks of it. Places where evil has taken hold, dear, hold luring monsters from far and wide are known as cursed zones. But I've never seen one this big. It's withered all the plant life in the area, even that big tree. It'd take a monster with powers beyond even a god to do this. That tree's an offshoot of Sakuya. It protects nature in the area. Maybe the natural beauty here would return if we revived it. But how the heck could we do that anyway? Okay, let's make not friends. Hey, come here. You're not gonna fight me? That's rude. There we go. It's what I thought. Let's go. That was not a good line. That one should work. Stuff and things. Only one good tree. Okay, I don't, I'm guessing we can't, nope, that's a mistake. Holy cow, this is bad. It looked like your regular old curse zone from back there. But the evil here is far worse close up. It would curse a normal person in a flash. I'm afraid it might even rob you of your power. Then let's not. I don't, I don't think we're going to be wanting to hang out in there. Unless we absolutely have to. We'll see if something comes up. I want my beads, darn it. Or I can't aim. Why am I like this? I'm not going to get too happy little trees. Oh, I did. Okay. That's fine then. Okay. Let's see. This little area is not super cursed. Oh, there's a people that way. Oh. More seeds. Yay, burbs. Okay. Ooh, yeah, that's not good. Well, you look at that, Ami. This guardian sapling is a wreck. So that's why Saki is hurting so bad. I bet the natural beauty would return if you revived that tree. But how could you possibly do something like that? You need a special power that can make a withered tree bloom. So... Sounds like we need another brush god power. I know my instinct, but I will not be going in that water. I remember enough from the last time I played this game to know bad things happen if you go in that water. I will show you that water. That is water. It's moving. We're not going in there. Another statue. Has everyone here turned to stone? They must have been struck by some terrible curse. The only way to help them is to rid this cursed zone of evil. Okay. <laughs> Up. Why am I like this? There we go. Two pretty trees. Okay, hang on. There's, yeah, this is the way we were coming. What does this sign say? Tuhana Valley. Okay.
I don't think it will kill me instantly, but I think it'll drain me faster than the regular water will. Or it might kill me instantly. I can't remember. I just know... Even though it's been a long time since I played this game, water bad. That water bad. There we go. It might be insta-death. Double pretty trees. Okay, what else? That guy... I'm sure we're supposed to, I'm not even gonna risk jumping that. There's a bridge over there anyway. Okay. I think they just keep showing up. Kamiki Village. Randomly in the sky. Nameless man's house. A long line of men who protected Hana Valley live here. Cool. Gonna get some bard seed so we can make more friends later. Is anybody home? Okay. Yes, I will in fact be attempting to cut down literally everything in this game. It's a problem. What just happened? I was out here chopping wood and communing with nature as usual, when I heard a loud rumbling like an earthquake from the lake. Then a huge gust of wind blew up out of nowhere. I don't know what happened next, but when I came to, it was like this. I noticed a figure running from the lake toward Kamiki. Whoever it was, man, I hope Mother Earth kept them safe. I bet I know. What's up, nature buddy? Curious about that cave? It's the entrance to a place called Hana Valley, you know? The site of an amazing waterfall, but monsters have moved in now. There's a trippy crystal ball that makes plants grow enshrined there. You'd think gardeners would be flocking here for it. Actually, not long ago, that Susano guy went marching in there. It's weird, normally he runs away at the sight of monsters, and he hardly seems the type to try his hand at gardening. Anyway, it's bad karma, man. You could be attacked if you went in. Not my cat will apparently be joining me today. Are you gonna be good? Okay, he's all done. If I can get my lines right. Nope, I didn't, maybe that just can't be cut or I was too far away. Not that water, sir. Why am I like this? There we go. Well, I always say I can't do anything straight. This would just be a good time to be able to. Only one pretty tree. Okay. I know they're probably just going to keep cropping up until we deal with whatever's going on here. There we go. That one wasn't as good. There we go. I want my good weapon, man. Nothing against this thing, it's just not not the one I want. I 
I think we're only going to get one pretty tree for this one. Yep. Nope. Uh, another statue? Has everyone here turned to stone? They must have been struck by some terrible curse. The only way to help them is to get out of the cursed evil zone. Is to cure the cursed evil zone. Get out, get out, get out, get out! Didn't like that. Don't. Oh. Nope. What the heck? Can I not get out now? Okay. It didn't stretch that far before. That was weird. I didn't like that. I guess because I'm like resting the thing on my leg or something, it's catching the button. Only one pretty tree. Okay, so let's go this way. I swear this used to be like a little mini game thing, but I guess really it doesn't take that long for games to load the way they used to. Hana Valley. Save. You obtained Traveler's Charm. Protects travelers from danger, increase godhood by one level. Nothing I can get to while that water is all funky. Oh, they're just having a little party up there, aren't they? I don't know. That's fine. Why is it sticking like that? Oop. No happy trees. Nope. Huh? We got rid of the monsters, so why did the gods' power disappear? Guess the curse on the gods of these lands must be really strong. They can't intervene till we do something about the stagnant air. Yeah. 
You obtained feed bag fish. Put that too far back. Fresh fish, irresistible to animals who dine on fish. Dig a ton and dig, dig a ton. There we go. Boop. You obtain stray bead. Find all the scattered beads and get a special reward. Oop, I really don't like those trees. Hey, check out that tree. It's moving. Better be careful, Amy. Oh, really don't like that tree. You see that? It, it just threw some fruit at us. Show it we mean business by... Show it we mean business. Try to hit its fruit back at it. Draw one quick, quick stroke to hit the fruit. You remember how, don't you? Okay, it's just straight up not going to let us pass if I don't do this. There it goes. Look, you, sh you stunned it with its own fruit. Let's pass... Let's pass on by this creepy old tree while we can. <sighs> Oop, that's just another angry tree. Oh, it's just gonna smack me with it. I don't see anything back here. I don't know why I'm back here. There we go. The statue's all dirty. I kind of feel sorry for it standing in a place like this. The statue's all dirty. kind of feel sorry for it standing in a place like this. I don't know how to help it, though. Ah! I'm going, I'm going. Oh, God. Susa knows here. Oh, that's a new problem.
Okay, I don't know why it seemed like the buttons were sticking for a minute. Oh, that's good. Why is he like this? Hmm? What's all that racket? Oh, it's you, Mutt. What are you doing here? Go home. I already told you I'm not looking for apprentices. Anyway, Hana Valley is no place for a mutt like you. Beyond this point lies my secret training ground. It's the perfect place to hide. Er, I mean to train. Now scoot, be off with ya. Sir, that is a wooden sword. Do you really want to have this conversation right now? That's strange. I know there's a way through around here somewhere. Hmm? What do you want? I already told you. Be off with you. Did not work. Figured I should try. Wow, check out that wall painting. It's said that a crystal sphere that makes trees grow is enshrined somewhere around here. Based on the painting here, I'd say the rumor must be true. Still, something's not right. Don't you think there's something missing from this painting? Yep. Yeah, that wasn't gonna work. There we go. Ooh. What in heaven's name? How did that happen? Well, now I can go hide. Er, I mean, now I can go train. It's a wall painting of an ancient ritual. It ain't half bad, and that's a lot coming from the Grady soon. Guess we're following the idiot. I almost face planted into that water. No one was going to have a good day. There we go. What a strange place. Is this really the secret training ground Susano mentioned? Speaking of which, where'd Pops go anyway? I don't know, but he's out of our hair for the moment. Sacred tree, cherry cascade. I haven't seen anything remotely like a sacred tree around here. Sir, your eyes, check them. What's up with this tiny sapling? Hmm. I smell a faint scent like sake is coming from the sapling. I bet I know where Susano is. Ah! That's the one thing that's always that always killed me with this game. The angles are reversed, so it always throws me off. This is a very conveniently placed saving mirror. I'm sure everything is fine. Anywho. Oh. Rawr. What now? You, you foul beast. How did you get in here? Foul beast? You have some nerve sneaking into my private training ground. Now you shall get a taste of my new secret technique. Your foul beast looks like an ordinary sleepy bear to me, Pops. Enough talk. My blade thirsts for battle. 
Here goes nothing. Susano style. Susano. Su. Oh, I guess I have to help him again. Sa. Nope. Seriously? What? What the? Let's try that again. Exploding implosion. Susano style. Susano. Su. Sa. No. Susano. Now for Susano style. Exploding implosion. Don't make me hit that bear. He's just sleeping. You're not bothering no- Oh. Ah ha 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 ha. That'll teach you, you foolish beast. You're no match for my new secret technique. He's literally sleeping. He does not care. <laughs> um, uh, rest in peace, foul beast. The great warrior Susano condemns the offense, not the offender. Anyway, there are other monsters I must deal with. I'm gonna check on the bear. I think he's still sleeping, though. I think he's fine. Sheesh. It's still a sleeping bear. Like a... Well, a bear. What a snore. Makes Susano sound like a kitten's purr. Hang on, we're gonna come back to that. I'm skipping around. Another place to draw the sun. What's up with this puddle? Looks pretty shintzy for what's supposed to be a grand altar. I bet there used to be something on here. Yup. We... Gotta go get our little orb friend. Examine. This crystal sphere is filled with leaves. Is this sphere used in a ritual for a good harvest or something? Hey, didn't that wall painting have a sphere-like object in it? <laughs> yes. What do we think? Do we think Susano took it to do something stupid? Or did the bear take it for some reason? For bear reasons. Completely legitimate bear reasons. All that said, yes, I think the bear is smarter than Susano. Without question. Push. There we go. Yes, go this way. Ooh. Wow, someone had a lot of time on their hands to think all this up. So this was that sphere in that wall painting. I bet this sphere here is magic or something. Oh hey, that worked. I'm getting better at that, apparently. Much better. 
Hey, is this a guardian sapling? It's all withered like the others. What the? Who turned out the lights? Oh, it's another constellation, eh, Ami? Nope, we had that right. Aw, looks like you need a little more than just one star. Why don't you try drawing all the missing stars? I did not realize there were two missing stars. I'm a dork. There we go. Ah, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. My gratitude for releasing my body from its slumber. Please accept my humble thanks in return for your great kindness. I am Sakigami, one of the triumvirate of flora gods known as the Hanagami. My brethren and I have been entrusted with the brush, techniques known collectively as green sprout. I now grant my humble power to you. Use it wisely. That was Sakigami, one of the gods of flora. Apparently, the bloom brush technique can make flowers blossom simply by drawing a circle on a withered tree. Hey! Maybe it'll make the withered guardian sapling blossom too. Quit fooling around, silly. Just draw a circle on the withered guardian sapling. I, I am! I drew the sun. I guess it wasn't big enough. Wow, look at how everything grew back so quick. Saku wasn't kidding about the power of the guardian saplings. So this is what Hana Valley's supposed to look like. Seems Sakuyu's guardian sapling has lifted the evil curse. I'm not sure how weak the gods have become recently, but it must have taken some wickedly strong power to suppress this magnificent guardian sapling. Even if you are Shiranui reborn, we might be up against more than we bargained for. Hey, Ami. What about that withered guardian sapling outside? I bet you could revive it like you did this one. And by bringing that guardian sapling back to life, we might be able to lift the curse there too. What are we waiting for? Leap before you think, right? That's not how that saying goes. Now that there's... Feast your eyes on that, Amy. The guardian sapling's in full bloom. With the power of bloom, I bet we could revive the guardian sapling outside, too. Much better. Yes, this game has amazing art. It always made me very happy. I'm cool, but I don't think I'm that cool. I don't think I'm supposed to go down there. Ah, fun. Okay. You obtained Demon Fang. 
Fang forged in demonic hatred, beautiful and deadly. Okay, now where'd that drummer dude go? Nope. No touch. Yes, double pretty trees. That's what we're here for. Hogs. I don't think hogs would eat fish or seeds. I guess we could seek. Oh, I... We got seven of these. I guess we can try. Okay. Are we friends now? Yep, we're friends now. We're gonna have soft tacos later. Where'd you go? Oh, back up here. It's a wall painting of an ancient ritual. It ain't half bad, and that's a lot coming from the Grady soon. He's already said that. Anything else right here? No. I'm pretty sure I either wouldn't be able to go down there or the drop would kill me. And I'm not really down for either right this second. Oh cool, these are still here. That creepy old tree just won't give up. I've got an idea, Ami. Maybe you could hit its fruit right back at it, and while it's stunned, you could use Bloom to rid it of evil. My, quest my circles are always questionable. Much better. Okay. The statue's all dirty, but that's proof that it's been watching over us for ages. I don't have anything that can shift water yet, or be water yet, or I could wash it. I think I get that power later. Whoa, Ami, hold on. Hana Valley looks so much better now, but what about this gloomy patch of grass? You can use the power of Bloom to fill it in. Just fill it with your your brush and Bloom will take care of it. Yes, I am an artiste. This is all completely fine. There we go. You obtained green sprout tips. Travel tips. There are a few places in this wide world where I have not set foot. My travels have granted me extensive knowledge. Endeavor to record this knowledge in a series of scrolls. Press Y to destroy breakable objects. You can initiate a dash, keep the left stick held down. Obstacles can be left over by jumping with B. Press B firmly to jump to greater heights. Perform wall jumps by pressing B when you contact a wall. Dashing and wall jumping will prove invaluable throughout your quest. To succeed, you must always be fully aware of your surroundings. Use the right stick to adjust the camera angle. L to change camera's distance. Map is displayed for as long as you press ZL. Certain areas are inaccessible until you obtain a map. The preceding tip should be of great value on your quest. Righteous knowledge is the wellspring of righteous action. This is the true essence of any adventure. Green sprout trips. Use the green sprout technique. Poke holes in the ground with dots. The ink becomes a seed and trees sprout forth, confounding foes. The life force of this ve vegetation emits is the bane of evil. There was a scroll here, too, eh? Ami, this looks like the travel guide. It's an ancient record of a pilgrimage across the land. If this were the real thing, it'd normally be worth a fortune. But with all the copies out there, you probably wouldn't get much for it. At any rate, if you ever want to read it, just press the plus to open the fan menu. It may sound rather preachy, but it should at least help you in your travels. 
Okay, let's go clean up this other tree. He's not going to throw stuff. He's just going to try to punch us. All right, there we go. I'm getting better. I've never actually gotten to draw the shapes before. PlayStation 2 didn't have controllers like this, obviously. Excuse me. Really? Got to be a certain size and everything. So picky. Can I bloom these trees yet? I guess not. Oop, one more. No, okay, I can't go in that water. How oh, cool these guys are back. Ooh, another demon fang, I think. Hello again. One more. Are you... Finally, okay. Yep, only one pretty tree for that one. Yes, much better. Fifteen praise. Boop. You obtain digging tips. Scroll drawn by a wandering artist contains useful information. I'm guessing with the rest of the... Ooh, we had a lot of books. Logbook, journal, revive guardian saplings. Hey, Ami, what about the weathered guardian sapling on the outer field? Bet you could revive it. And by bringing that guardian sapling back to life, we might be able to lift the curse there, too. I must apologize. Oh, God, this one's going to be a lot of words. I would like to reward you, but I'm afraid I haven't the power. Okay, yeah, that's just Sakuya not being strong enough. We already, She already gave us that speech. Digging tips. Press X to dig holes. The simple act has great depth. Spots that appear empty may emit light in the darkness. Dig with X in these spots to find great treasures. That is not the only advantages of digging holes. You may notice a green glow in areas with lush, lush vegetation. Dig there with X to reveal a wilted clover. Use the Celestial Brush to rejuvenate these clovers. The newly restored clovers will net you much praise. Green Imps. Rude monkey-like creatures that harass and tease humans. Whether frightening the locals or cursing out, causing outbreaks of disease, these troublemakers have proven to be the bane of humanity. Said to hide in gloomy places, they are portrayed as flautists. 
Red imps. These loot players are harder to exercise than green imps. One night, a man heard loot music and went out to find the source. Hiding in the shadows, he saw the imps stop playing and drink sake. Seeing his chance to attack, the man struck out, severing the loot strings with his blade. The imps disappeared in a wisp of smoke. It is advisable to cut the strings with the brush. And then our yellow imp. Folklore has it that these imps never cease in their mischief. Furrowing beneath the ground, they sound their mighty drums. The drums' vibrations shake the earth. Jump to avoid this attack. Legends tell us to lure them from the ground and strike from behind. Though riddled with disease, they are often portrayed whimsically. These stories are meant to make them seem less threatening. Why would you want to make a demon seem less threatening? Treasure Tome Dragonfly bead. Uniquely shaped bead that shines in multiple layers of color. I think, yeah, that, that looks like all we've got so far. Animal Tome These tiny birds eat seeds in an adorable manner. These cowardly animals charge when frightened. They enjoy seeds. These seed-eating babies can be identified by their stripes. Oh, and it keeps track of how many we've fed, so that'll be fun later. Okay, let's go get the other guardian sapling. Anything over here? Yes. There we go. Five praise. There we go. But I don't want to make deals with it. It doesn't... It keeps attacking me. It's not trying to make deals. I'll see if there's something behind that waterfall in a second. I did... Did, did not dig this up. Why am I like this? There we go. I'm just going to have to get used to the fact that I'm bad at drawing circles. Okay, no, I cannot go that way. Fair enough. I don't see anything here. I forget if I get a power later where I can turn night into or day into night. Because if I can, that would make it ten times easier to find all my hidden treasures. No, do that. Good plan. Can't fix those trees yet. Save. Yeah, they're not very good at their jobs. I don't think these are the deal kind of demons, though, so maybe they are good at their jobs. Spreading disease and stuff. Okay, that's a new brush technique in the bag. Now, Ami, before you get all excited and forget what you're supposed to do, I have an important tip for you. Ready? Okay, then. If you ever forget what to do next, press plus to open the fan menu, and then take a look at the logbook. You'll find your journal there. I just did this. Your journal is a record of the important dialogue you've heard. It shows all the important info you have in that furry little head. Just dig up info the way I just showed you, and you'll be able to recall important things. Your adventure will be a lot easier if you remember this. Also remember, first things first. Okay, let's get going. Oh, so it's not all cleared up, but that's what we're going to do the other tree for, presumably. Freaky, it looks like the river suddenly cleared up. 
I did see Susano whizzing past here a little while ago, but surely it wasn't him who cleaned up the river, was it? Nah, that wouldn't make any sense. See, this guy's got his head on, right? I like him. <laughs> That's what their thingy said. All the imps are like disease spreaders. Just jump in. Was he the only one in here? Crazy. Yeah. Double pretty trees. Wow. We're going there, huh? <laughs> Not no. Can't draw again. Hand broken. Can't do lines. Seriously. There we go. Only one pretty tree. Okay, so let's see what we can do. Yes. That was a big curse. Thirty praise. Wow, that nasty curse zone is completely gone. The plants and animals are back, and just feel that fresh breeze. Now that's what I call great divine intervention. <laughs> if you keep on dispelling the evil curse like this, I bet the gods of nature will lend you their powers. Yes. Hey, that's... That's Sakuya's tree, isn't it? Maybe she perked up because you revived a guardian sapling. Well, we can stop by and see her later. I mean, we're kind of on a roll here. How about we take a look around Shin Shinshu Field first? You've been gone a hundred years, right? A good run around the place will do you good. Boop. Boop. You obtained Fleeing Battle. Scroll drawn by wandering artists. Contains useful information. Only if you're a wimp, which I am. This is where all of our current moves lists are. I mean, we're kind of on a roll here. How about we take a look around Shinshu Field first? Okay, so we can look around or go talk to Sakuya. 
The demon's grudges may take form as what is known as a demon scroll. Physically contacting these scrolls draws you into a demonic realm. You will doubtless find yourself under attack shortly thereafter. Battles can be desperate affairs. Often you may wish to avoid them. If you can find a crack in the demonic realm's border, you can attack it, breach the border, and make your escape. This guardian sapling's back to normal, and the cursed zone that covered this area is completely gone. Now it can protect this land as it once did. But yeah, I'm gonna... Ooh, another one. You obtain Traveler's Charm. Protects travelers from danger, increases godhood by one level. Are those just in my tools? Yes. Godhood level is already maxed out. You cannot use this item. Rude. Now let's see. What am I doing here again? Oh, yes. I took shelter under this guardian sapling. When I heard that terrifying sound before, like a monster growling. Well, this is perfect. It's fate. Why don't I set up shop here? You know where to come when you're sent shopping, right, Pooch? Oh, yes. I don't know if you'll understand this, but here goes. I'd like to ask you a favor. It'll be a cinch with your nose. If you sniff out any nice bowls or dishes lying about, don't just leave them to rot away. Bring them to me, would you? If you turn up any treasures that are worth a bit, I'll pay you. Treasures? Hmm. You found anything like that, Ami? If you did, you should just sell it. I mean, what are you going to do with stuff like pots and dishes? It's hard to sell stuff you worked so hard to get, but don't worry. All the treasures you collect will be cataloged in the fan menu. What are you mumbling about? Have you got some things for me? Sure. I don't think she... I don't remember her ever changing form that much. What treasures have I collected? Oh. But I love my dragonfly bead. I know it just said it was cataloged, but it's so pretty. Fine. Don't want to sell any of that. But more seeds. Okay. Herbs. Get five of those. Get us five of these. Get us four more of the fish. That's expensive. It really increases attack, defense. I think we're okay with it for right now. Like, she never turns human or anything, if that's what you're asking. I'm a wolf the whole game from what I remember. Fight? Oh, okay. Not fight, just pain. Ah, that makes sense. Yay, more piggies. I will just give them some seeds. You're cute. This is why my roommate doesn't like me. I would totally bring home a tiny pet pig. I'm gonna fight it. Let's go. Just jump in throwing hands. That's how we do. Yeah, other one's already gone. Okay. Double pretty trees. Oh, that wasn't there before everything got cleared up. Let's use that. Yes. Okay. Oh. Traveling everywhere about 
Whoa. What's up with this old gate? I don't like the looks of it. It's just teeming with evil power. I can feel it. Still, you being a god and all, we can't just ignore it. What do you think, my furry friend? We going through it with it or what? <sighs> Fine. Go through the gate. Oh, not this guy again. Where? No touch. Yes, double pretty trees. Is it gone? Bunnies! So, that's it. Those things are gateways to monster lairs. I've heard of such gates before. They're called devil gates. Those monsters got a lot of nerve building things like that. Let's tear them down whenever we find them. Do I have bunny seeds? Quit tr telling me to bite stuff. Herbs? Yes. Bunny friends, bunny friends. This shouldn't be one of my favorite parts of the game. It's not even one of the most important parts of the game. Why does it look like that bunny's eating with its hands? Excuse me. <laughs> I'm slightly more concerned about these bunnies now. Okay, you guys have a good day. Oop. Dig ton of This is rude. There's another one of those things. Boop. I'm just kind of panning around to make sure we're not walking past anything besides that because I can't get to it because it's under rock. I'm sure something will fix that later, but for right now... I don't like it. That's going to drive me crazy. My lines have significantly improved. Collect in the treasure, double pretty trees. Obtained vengeance slip. Paper depicting karmic backlash temporarily deflects enemy attacks. Okay. Do I. I'm in a sun swirly. Do I need to draw a sun? I. It doesn't seem like that did anything, but. Okay.
She is doing her best. She's just trying. Hasn't been asleep for 200 years or whatever. I get it. Got all her powers split between 13 other gods. It's a hard life. Bunch of plague demons hanging around. I can relate to that. She's just having a hard time. Double pretty trees. That's what I like to see. This is a guardian statue, but I don't think anyone's been here in years. It's in pretty bad shape. I feel kind of sorry for it. Why don't you leave an offering? I don't... I wasn't trying to cut it. What do I leave? Yeah, I don't think that counts. Hopefully they explain later. Do I have stuff horses would want? Oh, not that. Yes. I'm making all the friends. What's this? Two dojo. Did I not destroy you? I thought I destroyed you. No, I'm uphill, aren't I? What about food? Don't do that to me. I don't need a horse eaten with its hoofs in this game. I don't need that trauma. How dare you? Get back up here. No touch. Nope. There we go. It, what, maybe. It wasn't letting me leave food, though. Well, I don't... All I have is, like, the stuff I'm giving the animals. Because the food I collect just goes in that little pouch for my health, and I can't get it again. But I can try and see if it'll let me once I'm done here. Nope.
Okay, the strategy is in fact confuse it. I cannot remember what I'm supposed to leave the statues. That is the problem my brain is having right now. Ah, it's a thing. Guess I'm gonna figure that out later. Huh? What a pretentious sign. Ami, this here's a dojo. It's where people come to learn sword fighting and martial arts. But who knows if they'll train you here. Maybe if you're a good wolfie, they'll teach you a trick or two. Every day I wonder why we don't just eat as soon. Seeds? Okay. Piggy friends. Okay. I saw smoke, but I mean, maybe that's supposed to be smoking? Well, what have we here? It looks like I have an adorable lupine visitor. My name is Onigiri Sensei, and this is my dojo. Fighting Master, Onigiri Sensei. What business could a wolf like yourself have at a dojo like this? Certainly you haven't come to study the fighting arts with yours truly. Sure. Haha, <laughs> I like the cut of your jib, my furry friend. I'd very much like to while away the hours that play with you. But I'm afraid that this place is far too dangerous for creatures like you. That is, of course, unless you can cover the training fee. I want my rosary. Let's hit your standard reflector. Sure. I'll be a monkey's uncle. You've got the cash, have you? I see. I suppose I have no choice. I'll do as you wish and allow you to enroll in my dojo. Ah. Oh. Can... Sir. Your... Your head. Wah. Oh. Are you mentally prepared to handle the ultimate challenge? Step inside to test your might. I mean, I I guess if you don't have an owner, you got to pay your own You got to pay your own way. Let the lesson begin. We'll practice the fleet foot god technique. Take these tips to heart and remember them as we train. Press ZR quickly and without hesitation. In doing so, you can quickly bound out of the way of incoming attacks. You will move in the direction you push the left stick. You can instantly execute a dash immediately following a jump. Press ZR to quickly leap away from impending danger. Well, did you understand? I'll grant you this technique scroll. Check it when you forget what it means to be a warrior. Good, because I absolutely will forget. This technique can only be mastered by the best. It is not something to be learned. You must have the innate ability. Train until your muscles ache, then train some more. Okay. 
found out that I'm doing that. Execute a dash immediately following a jump. Okay. get it. Can I leave? Because there's not a lot going on here. Ooh. I forgot I could do backflips. Had enough, eh? Listen, Wolf, gaining experience in a single skill is admirable. But you must never lose the drive for self-improvement. I pray you do not forget that. Mostly because he wants a bunch more money later. gonna cut his stuff down. It'll come back. I just wanted to see if he had any cool stuff. Oop. Stray beads. And this is why you gotta slow roll this game, because I want all of those beads. Okay, I think that's all here for right now. Is that another frickin'... Okay, it's not another statue of Nagi. To Pyrotechnist's house. I'm sure that'll go great. To Agata Forest. I guess I gotta go check out a forest later. That hurt me. In my soul. But it had to be done. Can I feed the hawk? Hey! Do you, do you want to be my friend? No? Is it because of the pun? I understand. To Pyrotechnic's house. Pyrotechnic, pyromaniac, same thing, really? Who's to say? Bunny friends. Because I really need this... Oh no, it was herbs. Why? Why are you using your toes to eat? It is unnecessary. Just looking at the cat next to me like, don't get any ideas. There's a crack in this wall, and there's a faint breeze coming through it. It might be worth our while to knock this wall down. You're sure all fired up, Amy. You really think that hard head of yours is going to bust the wall down? I mean, it's worth a shot, because I don't remember if this works. Oh no, that's right. That's why I need to go see the pyrotechnicist. Key cat. Hmm? Hey, get a load of this statue's face. It's got the same blank expression as you. Seriously, why don't we eat him? Hee <laughs> hee. Like Amy, I swear you don't gotta put up with him. I won't tell anybody. Oh, still missed that guy. There we go.
Double pretty trees. Yes, I can do my flips now. Ow, ow, ow. What's going on? Ida of the Dongong Express never trips up. I've fallen and I can't get up. Must be a curse. Express Messenger Ida. I don't have time for falling over. People are waiting for mail. Those monsters must have set some kind of trap for me as a joke. Darn it, I knew I should have bought a traveler's charm. Hey, pooch. That's a traveler's charm you got there, isn't it? You offered traveler's charm. I mean... I guess. Oh, yes. I feel so light, my body feels as light as a feather. Thanks, Pooch, you saved me. Can't hang about. Gotta catch up on my deliveries. I guess we got praise for it. It's fine. There's another scroll over there if I really want to do more fighting. Mostly just scouting for more buried treasure. More stray beads. Okay. It's about to be dark, so we'll be able to see them glowing. Feed bag herbs. Sweet herbs popular among herbivorous animals. I guess, yeah, we don't get the description until we win it instead of buying it. We don't need to go back that way right this minute. So let's deal with this guy. Dude, I'm drawing lines. Thank you. Probably gotta be a certain length and stuff to work right. I stopped holding the button. Don't do that to me. Double pretty trees. More bunnies. Oh! And other stuff. Non-bunny related. Nameless man's kiln. It's a big old kiln for firing pottery. Guess somebody works here. I bet they could make some sweet pottery in a kiln like this. Yes. I'm sure. Yes, he you're you're all you bunnies are doing fine. Thank you for being my friends. Oop. Take that. Take those.
Nameless man's kiln. Yep, same thing. Did we cap the pouch? And it's night. That means we'll have an easier time finding stuff hidden in the field, though. Because there will be a glowy light. If we get looking now. Just gonna zoom around the field and see what I come across. Oop, didn't mean to wake my little friends up. See, like that, but I can't get that because it's rock. Game really said I'm not allowed to have nice things. Oop. Seriously, stop sticking. Oh, anyway, so my Patreon is up. Um, for some reason, you can see the link on computer, but not on mobile, we figured out. So I just put um, my link tree info in my bio for people on mobile, but then we couldn't click it. So you can still, like, copy-paste. What? Off? tools yeah so I can't leave that stuff can't leave that because I kind of need it I think that's just our friend whose legs we fixed but yeah there should be a white glow for stuff if we missed any treasures. But we got that one. And I genuinely have not played long enough, or in, yeah, long enough in so long to remember where anything is. So we just gotta kind of run with it. Yeah, you get away from my horses. Who do you guys think you are? Yeah, if there's some kind of delay for some reason. Can't say I'm a fan. And it doesn't do it all the time. So that's cool. Stuff, stuff. Double pretty trees, so more monies. Okay. Now that my horse friends are safe, let's check over here. Dang it.
More warthog friends. And that feeds, I think that feeds the adults too. Yes. Getting that praise. Boop. Feeding. Really? Like I haven't already been doing that? Agata Forest Port. The ferry between Shinshu Field and Agata Forest docks here. The ferry used to run frequently, but it's been out of service ever since the water level dropped. And I do not currently have the brush skills necessary to fix what sounds like a problem that I should fix. But I can beat you guys up. That's a thing he can do. Ugh. We just gotta keep moving so he doesn't see us when he comes out. Nope, he saw us. Fudge. I continue to have no idea why I don't swear on this stream. That's way easier than beating him up slow. Aw, yeah, that one didn't do good at all. Oh, there's a spot we gotta clean up. Nope, this should work better. I feel like we gotta go deal with the pyrotechnic guy. To Agata Forest. This water lay this waterway leads to Agata Forest. It's the most green and fertile place in the region. I heard the villagers used to take the ferry to the forest long ago. Okay, so if there's no hidden treasures over here and it doesn't look like there is. Where? To shrine. That's specific. Did I not? There's my phone. Sorry, cat. Hang on, I'm gonna see what we leave as sacrifices. Or offerings. Okay, apparently we need, 
we get stuff from the nameless guy, get pots, give them pots. I'm sure I would have figured that out eventually. Look, I seen it. Give it here. More stray beads. Moon Shrine. People purify themselves here before visiting the Moon Cave. Oh dear me, dear me, this is awful. Priest of Moon Shrine, Mika. Uh, a most welcome guest has wandered into our shrine. Your timing is immaculate, Wolf. I need to speak to you. Outside is Lake Harami, Nippon's largest lake. In the middle of it, there was an old shrine called the Moon Cave. But it's completely disappeared, vanished into thin air. It enshrines the wicked demon that Nagi and Shiranui once defeated. It housed Tsukiyomi, the fabled sword that keeps the demon at bay. That demon, its name was... No, I'll be cursed if I say it. Anyway, the point is, what on earth has happened to the shrine? It's guarded day and night by the Tao Master Waka. On the one occasion he has to go back to the city, this happens. Oh dear. Oh, more to say. Lately, there have been monsters haunting these parts as well. Those mischief-making monsters are the worst. I expect this is their doing. Well, maybe not this time, but they still need to be dealt with. I've already prepared a wanted list for them. Mika's Monster Notebook. Okay. The gods will have marked all those wanted monsters with a sign. You'll know as soon as you lay eyes on them. However, they're very cautious. They only come out at night. Will you go put this list up somewhere obvious, Wolf? I'm sure some brave soul will step up to the challenge. You obtained Mika's Monster Notebook. May the gods protect you always. Hey, this is a sweet job for us, Ami. Let's keep this list handy and take care of them, mischief-making monsters ourselves. I mean, we're going to run into them whether we like it or not, so we might as well collect the reward too. Anyway, seems they only come out at night. Let's give it a shot. I should probably not stress that guy out more than he's already stressed out. <sighs> okay, so we're doing this. Onimaru the Incorrigible appeared. Cool. What's with this monster? It's got an exercising arrow stuck in it. Exercising arrows are sacred relics for driving away evil. That means somebody really wanted to get rid of this monster. Come on, Ami, finish it off. Don't let it get away. Onimaru, the incorrigible, defeated. He wasn't that tough. I got double pretty trees. That was one of those monsters from the monster notebook, and we just happened to find it. Boy, you never know what you'll find next. You know that monster notebook you have? Well, you can cross out the wanted monsters you've taken care of. The monster you just finished off is on this wanted list. Go ahead and strike the name off the list with your brush.
That's one less monster. At this rate, it won't be long before you can cross them all out. Once you defeat all the wanted monsters, go see the priest. Maybe he'll give you a reward. Find a priest. We'll go check out the shrine in a second. We haven't been to visit the pyrotechnist yet. Double pretty trees. Okay, no, he's biting his foot because he's a weird cat. I thought the cat had, like, snored. He's just eating his peats. I don't remember. I think the scrolls with the demons might, or the wanted things might be a different color? I can't remember now. Nope, he saw me. Almost there. Sneak attack, what? Did not do good on time, though. Get out of the way. Coming through. I've got a stack of night deliveries to make. Cool. So yeah, I guess we'll just hunt around for the monsters unless it turns day and then we'll go talk to the pyrotechnist. I'm sure we don't have to find them all in one night. What the frick? Come on now. Like I said, I'm pretty sure... The scrolls turn a different color if they have one of the wanted ones in them, but I could be wrong. I'm just going to see if we can find any that are a different color. Or is there only one in this area? I can't remember now. He might have been the only one in this area. Okay, let's go talk to the parent. I guess let's go talk to the nameless guy first.
see about some pots. Yay, more games with no fall damage. This is the life, huh? It's great to be clutching my axe again. See this kiln, friend? It disappeared when the curse struck. My workshop is my pride and joy. I'm stoked to have it back. I'm actually an artist communing with nature on a deep level, man. I can hardly wait to start firing up some pots again. I guess I just need to talk to him every now and then. Okay, let's go see the pyrotechnist. Burb, be my friend. These are some steep stairs. Try and make sure they're not hiding anything. Sneaky, sneaky game developers. Oh. oh my jeez. I forgot about them. Only one pretty tree. Let's see. That means I should have stuff in my guidebook about the fish now, though. New in my animal tome. Herb-eating rodents are known for their long ears. Pigs. Domesticated boars have cute noses and enjoy eating seeds. These swift creatures run like the wind and eat herbs. Horsies! I think that's all our new guys. Not what I was looking for, though. Travel guide. Feeding. Yes. Already doing that. Thanks, bro. Okay. These, the transformed spirit of a woman who threw herself into the sea. This demonic fish can fly by flapping its fins like wings. If you spot a fish carcass on the beach at night, it is recommended that you exercise the fin as if with a powerful slash. Doing so knocks the fish to the ground and sends them packing. Bonk. You obtained Vase. Vase whose unique beauty will surely outlast any flower. It's probably supposed... Yeah, because it's specifically said I gotta get the... Get the ones for the shrines from the... Nameless man. But I mean, it won't hurt to try.
double pretty trees. Seeds for the birds. I don't think we've had... Oh, I guess we have. Okay. Headbutt. Do you have anything? Nope. False alarm there. Bop. Legend of Verochi. Scroll drawn by a wandering artist. Contains useful information. Tools. Nope. Travel guide. Legend of Orochi. The hamlet of Kamiki lies nestled in the Shinshu field of Nippon. This village bears the burden of a sad and troublesome tradition. Each year on the night of the festival, the evil serpent Orochi appears and a white plumed arrow strikes the roof of a young maiden. Orochi consumes the girl's soul, ensuring his continued vitality. This continued for a hundred years until Nagi slayed the fearsome serpent. Even today, the villagers recount their sorrowful past. The full moon on the fifteenth night ushers in the eight-headed serpent. The sacrifice is chosen by way of an arrow decorated in white. Nagi engaged the beast in battle for the sake of his beloved Nami. Until his heroic act put the tra tradition to rest, ninety-nine girls had been slain. This is a fact we must not forget. Sleeping like a log, come back at night. You read the message. Guess we'll just have to come back tonight. Cool. I think I get wind power later. Maybe that's how I need to blow it away. Everything's night around here. I guess we can go check the shrine out now. Nope. I almost I almost did the dumb. We would not make it all the way if I tried to take the water route. Sometimes I remember things. I just want to be its friend. Moon cave entrance. Oh, that's not good. Huh? We passed under the shrine gate and followed the narrow path. So where the heck's the moon cave? It should be right here. Hey, what's with that big old mountain over there? Since when did that appear in the middle of Lake Har Harami? They say the moon cave is where Nagi slew the legendary beast. But that huge mountain is way too big for the moon cave, I remember. I mean, just look at it. It's massive. Just checking for hidden stuff.
Yep, that's gonna be a problem. Youch, what the heck? There's some kind of barrier here. Never seen one so powerful before. We're, we'd be better off staying away from this thing. Okay. So since we can't really do anything else here until night, I think we're going to go check on Sakuya and then wrap up here. Unless it turns night. Well, Ami, I think we've seen about all there is to see here in Shinshu Field. Maybe it's time we checked in on Sakuya back at Kamiki Village. Well, that was weird. What a coincidence. Yeah, that's, that's a sound. Somebody somewhere has fucked up. Is everybody gone again? <sighs> wow, what's all this? The village is just bustling with activity. Wonder what's going on. Bunny friends. Ahaha, ha, what a joy to see life returning to the land. Just 15 more to go. We will be blessed with a miracle when all the trees are in bloom. Interesting. Oh. Well, if it isn't Snowball, hard at work guarding your territory? A most refreshing breeze suddenly started blowing today. How many years has it been since Konohana was green and fertile? Back then, the village's trees were in full bloom. Why, if it isn't the new king of hole digging. That old man is all excited about the sacred tree's recovery. Yes. Puppy friend. I can't believe it. Our sacred tree, Konohana, covered in leaves. Should be a good season for my turnips, too, then, I guess. Did I already feed? Yes, they have hearts. I already fed them. Oh, of course, now it's about to be night. Hey, Asakiya, my little blossom. You're looking mighty fine, thanks to us. Hey, why doesn't she say something? Hmm. Come to think of it, I haven't seen her around lately. She didn't kick the bucket, did she? Come on, Sakuya, let's see that pretty little face of yours. I know, let's ask old Mr. Orange what's going on. Sis, sis the tree suddenly burst out in leaves. I, I know, I saw it too.
I guess we can go to his house. Oh, I almost forgot. I promised you some cherry cakes, didn't I? I'll get you some fresh ones in a jiffy. You wait right here. Upsy daisy. <laughs> this lady's crazy. Phew. Take these with you, dear. They're best when they're fresh. You consume cherry cake. Cherry flavored sweet bean cake fills astral pouch a good deal. Oh, my pouch is full. Look at me go. Nothing to eat here. Why, it's Snowball. Where have you been? A most joyous event occurred while you were gone. She had been withered and leafless, but as you no doubt noticed, she has made a miraculous recovery. My dancing must have made a connection with the sacred tree. However, she still won't respond to my questions. Perhaps her evil-plagued spirit has ascended to heaven? No, it cannot be. But if it has, my secret Konohana shuffle shall summon it back. Is that some kind of dance? Now you're talking, Gramps. If only. If only I could harness the power of the earth. Come to see Konohana shuffle, have you? Well, I don't expect my dance to have any effect right now. I need the power of earth to save the sacred tree spirit. That is the only power that can restore all our withered trees. And if I were to perform that sacred dance, I I would never again... Oh, just look at me. I've become so gloomy in my old age. I shall save the Konohana Shuffle until after all our withered trees are restored. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save. I think it's a... This... Yes, it's right over here. I'm going to wrap it up, and I will see people on Monday. Have a good weekend.